I am Willy Wonka, the greatest candy maker of all time. Come, Come with, with me, and you'll be in a world of pure imagination. Take a look and you'll see into your imagination. Charlie from a long line of distinguished candy men. And women. Well, Wonka hasn't hired anyone since Slugworth spiced all his candy balloon recipe. Wonka was so angry, he gathered all his workers saying, I'm sorry, but you all must go home. Then he locked the gates of his factory forever. But Mr. Wonka still makes candy. I can smell them on my way to school. Yes, but no one comes in and no one goes out. Shadow workers. You can take a sunrise, sprinkle it with dew, cover it in chocolate and a miracle or two. The candy man, the candy man can. What's the world come to when the family can't even afford the paper? Wonka factory open to a lucky few. Do you mean people are actually going to be allowed inside the factory? Read what it says. Mr. Willy Wonka has decided to allow five children to visit his factory. The lucky five will tour your factory and receive a lifetime supply of Wonka chocolate. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. People are buying over 50,000 Wonka bars every hour. That's Veruca, you imbecile. Veruca, Veruca, Veruca! We'll begin with a spin Traveling in a world of my creation What we'll see will defy explanation Ah, uh, shut it, Ma. You flap your jaws as much as I do. Now, Violet, I don't appreciate that sort of language. Yeah, well, I got a ticket. Big deal. Means I'm going to have to miss at least an hour of my second favorite show, and I'm going to have to leave the house to tour some stupid chocolate factory. Right. Whatever. Hit him! Hit him harder! It's all candy, and it's all edible. Look over there! It's some sort of creature. <laughs> Grandpa Joe, what's that? Try it. And if I don't get the thing that I am after, I love your factory. It's the most wonderful place in the whole world. There is no place I know to compare. 